All right, Rachel, thanks a lot. Jefferson County has a new top cop, a new district attorney. Three weeks ago, Governor Ivey appointed Mike Anderton to run the Birmingham office. Only on CBS 42, Jeffco District Attorney is here to talk about his appointment and what's ahead for his office. Good to have you with us. Good morning. Thank you for having me. Now, working in the, in the district attorney's office is nothing new for you. You've been no. there for 33 years. Yes. Talk about some of your accomplishments over those years. During the course of the 33 years I've tried major capital cases, I've tried murder cases, um, I became a division chief uh, or a supervisor uh, early under David Barber. I've worked uh, with seven different district attorneys, uh, not only here but also in Alexander City where I started out. Mm -hmm. um, I participated in the Play by the Rules program, which was a, a booklet book put together by a nonprofit over at uh, Samford University, the Alabama Center for Law and Legal and uh, Civic Education. Yeah. Uh, it taught children what the laws were in the state of Alabama and put it into their language so that they weren't reading legalese, right. they, were, they were actually reading the law. Very important to do. This appointment comes at, uh, as district attorney after a jury found former district attorney D.A. Charles Todd Henderson guilty of perjury. How important is it to restore integrity to the office? Jefferson County's D.A. office has always had integrity. Uh, under Earl Morgan, under John DiCarlo, David Barber, uh, Brandon Falls, and uh, we've always had integrity. But this was a hit because people were listening to the name of District Attorney of Jefferson County charged with perjury. We will uh, restore any lost integrity, but the people of the office of Jefferson County's DA office have got integrity. The prosecutors, the, the support staff, we've got a great staff, yeah. and every one of them have the integrity to uh, keep this office going. Now you said in, in your release that you look forward to leading my office in the pursuit of justice, citizens' trust, and victims' right. What does that look like in practice, and especially for some African Americans who feel like they, that they have not always gotten justice from, from the department? Anytime someone has an issue uh, with our office or with local law enforcement, I wish they would call me. I wish they would contact us, talk to us about that. I'm willing to meet with anyone uh, at all. Maybe they've suffered an injustice in the past. Maybe it's something that they're perceiving because they don't understand the system. I'm more than happy to sit down with them and talk to any leader out there to uh, alleviate that. What's the one thing you want to do as the new DA until you have to face an election next year? We've got to try to figure out how to stop some of the heroin uh, problem here in Jefferson County and some of the gun violence. We've got to figure that out. Random uh, gun violence. A lot of it is uh, people who know each other and get mad at each other, someone pulls a gun. Hold a thought. If you would stick around, we can talk on Facebook more it. about that. This is the new DA for Jefferson County, Mike Anderton, in place now. Let's get a check of your weather and traffic together. Here's Storm Track meteorologist Ashley Gant.